Two at 10 tonight, two Tulsa families are forced from their homes. This after a fire ignites in their duplex. The scene takes us to a neighborhood near West Pine and Gilcrease Museum Road in northwest part of the town. That is where we find 2 News reporter Asia Vickers, who spoke to some of the family members. Asia. Well, Jason, on one side of this duplex, a family's lost their home. On the other side, some damage. But despite this tragedy, people are doing okay. At around 5 Saturday, Sue Barton got a call no one wants to get. We were over to a friend's house, and the neighbors called and said, come home right now, your house is on fire. It's the home she's lived in for 16 years. On the other side of this duplex, Charlie May Thornton's home and, uh, of 14 years. This is just very overwhelming, you know, because this has happened to me once before when I was growing up. Our house was burned like on Easter. Fire crews brought in two extra engines and a rescue task force to fight the blaze, which started in Barton's home. Officials believe her site is a total loss, while Thornton's home suffered smoke, fire, and water damage. These condos are pretty old, and it doesn't look like there was a firewall in place, because it did spread pretty quick. No one was hurt in the fire, and even though she's lost her home so close to the holidays, Barton says she still has many things to be thankful for, like family. We may be displaced, but we won't be lost without uh, people around us. And fire, fire officials say they are now investigating, and it could be a while before we know the cause. Live in Northwest Tulsa, Asia Vickers, 2 News works for you. All right, thank you, Asia. The Red Cross is providing shelter, food, and clothing for the families for the next couple of days.